sat at the hospital waiting to go down. Uh, but I've got changed. I've come in from transport. Uh, just in case none of you know what I, why I'm here, I'm having a spinal injection. So I've had about seven jabs in my spine to help me with movement because I get a lot of pain with my back and my legs and everything. So these injections help and everything. So, so listen, I'll catch you on a bit because they've told me I can't film when I go down there. So I will either catch you when I come back or when I get back home. See you in a bit. I've had the procedure done and there's been a complication with it. My left, no, my right leg is totally numb. I've no feeling in it at all. And my foot's really, really swollen and it's tickling. So they've decided that they're keeping me in tonight and then I'm going home tomorrow. So I'll keep you informed as we go along. The doctor's just been again and he's going to be giving me a blood thinning injection. My leg's still completely numb. I've no feeling in it. It's like it's dead. I can't lift it up or anything. And my foot's burning. Feels like it's burning and it's tingling all the time. So, so I'm just going to wait for the injection. So I'll catch you all in a bit. Hi everyone, it's next morning. I'm feeling loads better. Uh, the pain's totally stopped in my foot. Uh, I can move my leg again. I've got no problems at all. Uh, the staff have really looked after me. And yesterday for tea I had fish and chips in Offville. It was it was lovely actually. Really nice meal. So I'm due to go back home uh, later on this afternoon. So I will see you all back at the cabin. Check this out. I've just had the trolley dolly come, proper dolly bird come and gave me a coffee. Milky coffee, NHS coffee, can't be NHS coffee. I enjoy that me, I like me NHS coffee. But she just gave me a treat. Let me show you what she's gave me. Oh, I'm so lucky. Yeah, hold on, I've got to turn camera around. She just gave me two custard creams. Oh, custard creams are my favourite of all time. Lovely NHS coffee. Oh, dinky do. I'm going to be going anytime now, waiting for transport, so saying goodbye to my room. Thank you for looking after me. Hi everyone, welcome back to the cabin. Uh, I'm back from hospital. I came back about three hours ago. I've had a couple of hours sleep. I didn't sleep well in hospital. Uh, and I'm back to normal now, near enough. They've told me that I can't make any decisions, financial decisions for 24 hours. And I'm not supposed to buy anything off the internet for 24 hours, God knows. I'll tell you a funny story about that in a minute. I've got my NHS band on still. They told me I've got to keep that on for 24 hours. The last time I was in hospital were about two years ago, having this procedure done on my back. And they said to me, whatever you do, don't be buying anything online or out like that. I'm thinking, don't be so daft, what you're on about. Anyway, I came home and I remember going on the internet, but I can't remember anything about it. Anyway, three days later, this parcel come in the post and it were a machete. So I don't need a machete. True story, that. True story. So I won't be ordering anything. I'm not going on into that, so God knows what could turn up. Right, now, this week has been a busy old week. We've not done any building work. Obviously, we've had really bad weather. Today is beautiful weather, but like I said, I'm taking it easy just for today. Now, we've had some deliveries. We've had a new hob, which will be fitted on the worktop in the kitchen when we, have, when we start building the kitchen. And we've also got, oh, the hob's propane. And we've also got uh, a Beko cooker as well that's come. And uh, we went online and we ordered the nozzles for it to convert it to propane. They came in the post yesterday while I was at the hospital. Uh, so we're going to fit the cooker next week and then we'll get uh, a gas man to come 
and connect the nozzles to the Beko cooker. We've, I've never done out like that before, so I don't want to get that wrong where it comes to gas. So I might as well just pay them. And I might even get them to service the boiler while they're there as well. So, so that's about it really for what's been happening this week. Now before I go, just before I go, if you're new to the channel, if you could press the subscribe button if you've enjoyed the video or other videos I've got. I've got about 460 something videos that I've made. So there's a big back catalogue if anyone's interested in watching it. all supports the channel with the adverts on it. So if you could do that, really appreciate it. Uh, if you enjoyed this video, if you could put the thumbs up in this video, and if you could leave a comment, really helps a lot with the YouTube algorithm. The channel's been growing well, and it's all down to you for putting your comments, putting a thumbs up, and pressing subscribe. This video, I dedicate all my videos to the Patreon section. We have a member section. There's a link down below in the description. It's £2 a month for the Patreon if anybody's interested in supporting the channel. And all money raised goes back into the channel to buy building materials or buy things we need like the cooker and things like that on the hob. Uh, but we're offering a seven day free trial if anybody's interested at the moment. So if you want to sign up, see what you think to it, that'd be great. Now listen, I will leave you in peace this time and I'll see you next week back down at the cabin. And don't ever forget, don't ever forget, dinky-doo. Stay safe, stay well. See you next week.